hungry again. What do you got over there, John? Raspberries. Have a raspberry? Who bought the strawberries? These are good. Six, I'm oh, I wanted the big strawberry. Guess I'll settle for that. No, Carter, did you hear uh, what, what about everything next? Uh, what about everything next? Okay. Are you gonna do that guy? Yes. Nice. Let's uh, let's get to it though, because we got a lot of ground to cover. Quick couple words on how things are going. And, um, having a blast. How you're feeling? Having a blast. I'm always feeling good. It's good to be out here. It's good to be in the sun, playing music. Always having fun. <laughs> Everything sounded good on your end. You get. Okay. Jason, you guys holler when you guys are ready.
to a good start. <laughs> watch me, watch me with the changes. <laughs> Wind in the leaves crawl from my bed The forest floor opens itself to clear my dusty head Wind in the leaves along a sylvan path Your memories grow inside me like a knotted branch Rushing by like a spirit Like a banshee through the trees Moving everything in sight Still sight unseen Rushing by like a spirit, like an angel through the trees Is that for me? Is that for me? Wind in the leaves along a sylvan path Your memories grow inside me like a knot of brass From somewhere on the forest floor a muted roar, a muted roar songs that it yeah. is because if we do carter's acoustic configuration we do love loss yeah love loss is on everyone has to do that at night okay well yeah uh, just really. pretend it's dark i'm thinking like this gray sky love loss war troubles one prairie one uh, one, one, one prairie or troubles let's do one prairie or before i switch tunings this is sounding solid that, is that something we we're happy to do electric? One prairie? Yeah. I used to sure. do it on uh, live scene. Yeah, yeah. I mean, uh, as, like this whole setup. Yes. Do you have a lap steel? Ah, oh, yes. good. Can I play upright or should I do my, uh, my hollow body bass? Ooh. 
Ooh. God, those are two good choices, man. Upright. I think I should give the snare a plus five. I like that. Remember what you did. All of our all of our gain settings have been in five dB increments. So. Kind of a pain in the ass to do that, though, Doug. But you know what they say. No pain, no gain. <laughs> Not been here since I was a boy The sky unwrapped the world my toy A movie reel a million miles long It goes on and on Scene after scene passes by my life The window's a wound, the road is a knife The irony asked me where have you been? I don't know, I don't know Because I don't know where to begin Too much to do, too much to see Pictures to take people to me when there's so much space in between It overwhelms me Scene after scene passes by my life The window's a wound and the road is a knife The irony asks me, where have you been? I don't know, I don't know Because I don't know where to begin Not been here since I was a boy Now a heart full of fear and a mask of pain and joy So much for these youthful eyes to see So much for peace and tranquility One prairie outpost you are how I feel
everything set up to capture everything for starters and um, all I'm doing over there is monitoring seeing what uh, what takes worked out well I'm trying to have an extra set of ears on things you guys they're gonna want to pay attention to their performances um, try and see if anything's clashing not working the reason we should try and cut something again trying to present something that looks like uh, the way things are on stage and something that's flattering for the pretty cool environment that we're in. It's, uh, it's a little more raw, it's a little more live, um, but that's sort of what we want to showcase. We go into everything pretty ambitiously. Um, so we kind of came in with a, with a huge list of stuff that we wanted to shoot, um, songs we wanted to tackle, arrangements we wanted to do, and they've got such a catalog to go through.
I see you found a box of my things, infantry, tanks, and smoldering airplane wings. These old pictures are cool. Tell me some stories. Was it like? The old war movies. Sit down, son. Let me fill you in. Where to begin? Let's start with the end. This black and white photo don't capture the skin. From the flash of a gun to a soldier who's done. Trust me, grandson. War wasn't coming. Before I bore a son, what good did it do? Hopefully for you, a world without war, a life full of color. Where to begin? Start with the end. This black and white photo 
never captured my skin Once it was torn from an enemy thorn Straight through the core, the war was in color Can't see, probably gonna get blown up. Safety people at home are probably mad right now. I'm using the lighter as a poker. All right, just gonna let the grill warm up. Just do that. <clears throat> I think we do that as a quick cut. We say cut to them, it'll just be a B-roll, so they cut it. You know, we started uh, the band over 25 years ago when we were in college and I was friends with Carter and Barry before the band started, so it was a natural progression. And then we graduated and we just decided to keep going and eventually learned how to play our instruments and write songs. We kind of grew up together, you know, in a literal sense as, as men, but also as a band for, it was really our, all of our first real bands. I played in a couple of high school bands, but really this is my first real serious band, and I know it's the same thing for Carter and Barry. It's great to be able to come down and remove ourselves from our daily lives and just hold up just the band and crew and a space like the beach where you have, you know, the ocean and the, and the weather and, and more importantly, all of us and all the energy captured in one space. Can't go anywhere, can't do anything, but live, breathe music and bounce ideas off each other. Yeah, I don't know. We'll definitely figure out something if that's on the list. I might have to go get the. Yeah, I might have to change. Yeah. I might or change setup. Save, yeah. save a couple of those songs for end if we're changing setup. Like, yeah. we should prioritize what we want to do. Do the same configuration. And then if there's a couple of songs at the end that I need to change setups for, I can. This particular trip, we we just we had such an aggressive timetable to get as much stuff done. Being a video project, just hardcore, you know, recording all the time that there was not a lot of downtime just to um, be creative and bounce ideas off of each other and, you know, hang. So it's, it's 10.30, we've got four hours. What time will we We can get like six or seven acoustic songs in all likelihood. And three of them are gonna be gathering songs. Do we have a sense of what three other songs like? A yes or no on Boxer? No. Yes or no on Trucker's Club Band? Should we do that in another arrangement? I would say another arrangement. I love these dudes. They're my best friends, and that's one of the best parts about being in this band is, you know, I like hanging out with these guys. So I wish there was a little bit more non-working hangout time when you just pick up a guitar and, you, you know, bounce ideas off of each other. You go for a swim, you know. It's just been such a furious pace because we had so much stuff. We have so many songs that we want to capture and record and, and do that 
in order to meet that schedule we just was like go 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 so now it's like all right we're grilling burgers it's midnight and we haven't had lunch yet but we're <laughs> it's like we can do this it's gonna be you know so that's my only my only complaint is not enough downtime to actually hang because i like to hang as much as i like you know playing music with these dudes so
take some time to get away and you will have to build from what remains to run it takes the courage of a lamb to love the fierceness of a storm
Rolling here.
and turn around at the edge of town We'll continue down to the other side And ride and ride till we see our lives And see our lives from outside Our city walls and the darkened halls And the lonely calls And when we turn around and head back in Everything will be new again Everything will be new And when the high wind blows everything Jason, you let us know when you're close.
I need to feel redeemed I wear my heart on a crying sleeve I bear the pressure of oil and moving steam Unaware of my gaining speed Unprepared to move ahead and take the lead Under the wire I'm a train down the line With nothing left to lose again But distance over I am a steel freight train
Since what a nickel's age Time to settle on There's nothing left Just be the life inside Just be my place of rest Where do love a star In a starry eye Stood upon you to carry me away, to carry me away, to carry me away, to rest in your silent lullaby when there's not a whole lot left. Keep cradling the pieces of everything I am, all of my love, 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 Thank uh-huh. 
So, did you mess with my mix? Some again? Hey, hey. Oh, let's go. All right, let's go. 13 and a half minutes of straight music. John, let's go. Come on, let's go. I'm sorry. John, it'll be great. <laughs> <laughs> Still rolling on. Still rolling.
tears sweated out To the pale's grief from bottomless on the flames that brought the drought Switch on the bright lights, turn on this town Run the through light, turn to powder and dash me on the ground Leave my blue suede shoes by the door Life extraordinary with me. If I could name you in the song, could make you smile and sing along. This is the goal to get into your soul. If I could make you dance for joy, that'd be the second chance to go in the bird of hand. I would need to help you understand. The nights came into my life, but it took the bones of me, took the bones of me, and blew away.
great. It's great being the new. Uh, it's great being the new guy. Now I think it will be like two years in November, but compared to 26, that's pretty new. They still won't let me wear my my tank top during the shoot, which is a little ridiculous, but you know, whatever. <laughs> this is a nice end to to uh, to a long long month, you know, just traveling around playing shows. You know, we're working, we're working really hard, but it's uh, this is making it pretty worth it. <laughs> Um, it's cool, like having the all the glass windows and be able to turn around and be like, all right, there's the beach. It just makes it just fun. It's a little warm, <laughs> but, but it's cool. It, it sounds great. I think it looks really cool. And uh, yeah, I mean, what's better? What's better than being at the beach? Not not too many things. <laughs> Oh, there's a dolphin. See that? Or whale, whales, dolphins. That's pretty cool. You don't get to see that in uh, in Boston. It's uh, it's like off. Uh, they just oh, see, off to the left there. That's what I was out here to see. Pretty fair, I like that. All right. Okay. Ready, Ruth? I am rolling. Rolling, we're all set.
Bit or goo.
show where the fishermen gone resting at home deep in the lungs just out of reach singing a song singing a song Take the aloe plant home with me. <laughs> Say hello to my little friend. <laughs> Say hello to my little friend. <laughs> Say hello to my little friend. Good to go. More feeling, buddy.
So I'm just, just off the top of your head, what do you think would be a, an okay idea? Um, yeah, all right, well, why don't I call the ones and you can say, definitely, I could do acoustic. Gray Sky, Raise the Roof, War, Two Aging Truckers, which is what you're Yeah, Two Aging right Truckers would be cool. To play acoustic? Yeah. And then um, comfort. Drums are acoustic. Probably drums. All right. Troubles. Um, probably acoustic. Compelling. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Um, this is my workspace. Well, now it's my looking at shoes on the internet space. So sweet. What is all this junk? I don't know, it's your workspace. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna, let, we should probably officially document you eating a donut. Because he's been good all week. I haven't been good all week. I've been, I was good for like one. John's week. been driving into town each night and saying he's he's gonna go work out somewhere, but I think he's just in the parking lot <laughs> eating junk food. <laughs> <laughs> he's got a Harris Teeter. He's crying, <laughs> gummy bears. <laughs> Excuse me, 
Uber Eats, could you meet me in the parking lot behind Harris Theater? It's too much shame for me to go buy this stuff myself. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm really close. Working too. Straightening up. <laughs> Let's make sure these boxes. Which is actually are. what it, he usually does in the kitchen. Hey, good. Just got these. I want to point out. We should probably highlight the cameraman at some point. I want to point out Ruben here. You can see the precision that most of us have with our lettering. This is. This was this was Ruben's this morning. This, is, this was Ruben's this morning. <laughs> I, I fixed it so it looked actually like a... <laughs> so it looked like this. I'm, I'm all about the detail. But even, even, even fixing it, this is as good as it got. And this is the guy you hired? You're paying money to that guy? Yeah. It's insane. Jason doesn't even... This is Jason's. This is Jason's. He was like... Oh, I stand corrected. Smart. He's the, <laughs> he's the only guy that thought to get a piece oh of tape. Oh my God. His name <laughs> we're not, like tearing. Not something, not something that's going to leave like schmoolists all over each, when we're done. Each one of us is like taking big strips of gas. And <laughs> anyway, there you go. It's been a ton of work, wouldn't you say? A ton of work. A ton of work. Last two days particularly have been like, uh, yesterday was an 18 hour day, beginning to end, like from when I got up to when I put my pillow, my head on the pillow, and, um, and it was pretty, pretty intense, like nonstop all day, but uh, it was good. It feels good to... I feel like, I feel like we've really minimal meltdowns. Minimal meltdowns? Yeah. Had a couple. A couple of hot meals help, you know, a few a few little breaks in the day, but um, we got a lot done, and uh, I think I think it feels it feels good to like stretch the work muscles hard like that every now and again, you know. And uh, yeah, if you're gonna you have to say if you're gonna do something really difficult, do it right on the end of a month long difficult thing. Right. So we just, we literally, and, and so to put it in perspective, we drove, you know, we finished the last night of our April tour, which was th uh, th about th three weeks, pretty much, of touring, and um, um, came from Pauling, New York on, uh, on Sunday night, and John drove us home from Pauling, which is like a seven hour, seven hour stint, uh, straight back to Richmond after the show. Uh, swapped some gear and got our little putter van switched uh, the whale uh, switched the, uh, the whale for the putter van there and came straight down uh, to the beach and got got right to work so we wanted to do it right on the trails the, the tails of our of our tour so that we kind of had our, our road mindset which is a you know pretty intense kind of work mindset um, and also just have our performance kind of chops as opposed to having a few weeks off and then trying to learn to ride the bike again. It was important that we got kind of like the hard the real hard work done, you know, with the the plugged in atmosphere, and, and now we um, you know, now anyone just want to take a couple of days and and use the cottage in a more natural setting and uh, sit around and be able to hear ourselves communicate musically in in the room without too much uh, without too much sound kind of bouncing off the walls. Just take it easy a little bit and 
maybe find some different voices for some of the songs that we might not we might not know about otherwise. It's fun. It's fun playing with Jesse. He's been with us for two years now. It's hard to believe. And he's he's added so much, and he's kind of reinvigorated, you know, a love for a lot of the, the catalog that we're slowly kind of digging back into, you know, some stuff that we haven't done in a while. And he's learning. He's learning a lot of the stuff on guitar because he's a great guitar player as well, and it just adds a musicality to. Our, our 25, 26 year kind of journey. It's like, oh wow, this song has value again. Let's, let's bring it out. Add a different spin to it. Yeah. Right on. Sounds like they're. Uh, so Terry's teaching. Jam right now. Terry's teaching Jesse the guitar chords for, for the truckers. Um, so I guess he won't be on drums on that one. Questions on the top? Yeah. Just go through that course. Okay. A horse needs to run, a heart needs to bleed, an engine can't gain the miles if it's kept pristine, if the view of change is constant, just like I've been told. Any backyard to bound the start to all directions unknown. Will I be there? Will I be there? When all the stories fade, will I am out of breath? My yoke is your yoke is resting on our shoulders and we share the weary load. My yoke is. You're you just like two aging truckers down the road. Ah, ah. Children of our parents, a storybook held close. A mom and dad's heartfelt work is worked down to the bone. And the leveraging that everything So a palace for a home The remains of the day Would never show, never know Will I be there? Will I be there? When all the stories fade When I am out of breath My yoke is Your yoke is Rest in
Myself, gents. If I get, I get too close. <laughs> Thank you. Your collar's kind of, speaking of lobs, kind of rolling in on you. But also, there's holes in your shirt, so I don't think it matters. And barely. Yeah, you're out. Dude, it's, it's a dirty bird shirt. It's a dirty bird shirt. It's a dirty bird. It's a dirty bird shirt. It's a good shirt. We should sell those dirty bird shirts. <laughs> It would be a long time. We should sell a dirty bird shirt. Dirty bird shirt. Oh, oh. Oh. Uh, Terry. Me. Okay. All right, you ready? All right, Terry, we're good. All right, ready to roll? We're rolling. We're all set. Oh, 
I would. I wrote the music for that and actually named it that. Barry got it, wrote the song, and I loved the song. And we went to Nashville to record the follow-up to Indian Summer. We were in Steve Earle's studio, which, big Steve Earle man, so that was amazing. So we were gonna do that song, and uh, Peter Collins, who just recorded the Stray Cats' first studio record, I think in forever. But anyway, so he was producing the record. Uh, he took the song and cut out half the words. I was just devastated, you know, because I didn't feel like this, the story was told all the way through. When we re-recorded the record, that was the one thing uh, that I was adamant about. It's like, if, if we're gonna redo this record, we've gotta put all the words back in this song. I kind of gave up all my other chips in the game for the whole record uh, just to get those words back in. And now I just want everybody to hear the version that has all the words so you know the full story of the song. I'm very excited because I'm sure very few people pick up on that and they just kind of wonder why it's so long now. Um, but uh, the words, uh, the words are great and um, it's nice to be playing the full version of that song. Oh 
Something warm to help remember A block of wood that used to be a Strong, tall family tree a Strong, tall family tree Blowing in the breeze Check out all the detours off the 405 But you can stay if you believe Spinning gold is never easy when shooting stars Are your dreams up in the sky? A star's just a star The funny thing when looking up It seems to follow you wherever you And I dream about her even though I never should Miss Hollywood, Miss Hollywood, Miss Hollywood Yeah, I would ride into the sunset if I could Miss Hollywood, Miss Hollywood 
Hollywood, Miss Hollywood And I dream about her even though I never should Miss Hollywood, Miss Hollywood, Miss Hollywood Yeah, I would ride into the sun like Clint Eastwood Miss Hollywood, Miss Hollywood, Miss Hollywood So slow to fade started doing this one mic I said you know I was like come in come in right on that part yes don't you cry yeah but and then, and then, like, and then a couple nights I didn't do it and let him do it and that, that felt like it was quiet in the audience and they were engaged and it sounded good and so I was yeah. leaving that space I didn't well, do it twice as long like I had used to it was yeah. only one yeah even and I just I'm just throwing my opinion out there we can do whatever I think it doesn't it doesn't do anything I th- good for us to I think leave it, space. In, in my opinion, I think it does because, you know, it's the first time where kind of everything clears out for a microsecond and just lets your ear take a little break and lets the listener go, oh, I'm thinking about my day and whatnot. Me, I, have yeah. I always think you're about to come in and nothing happens and I'm, so last minute I'm like, I guess, uh. so I always assume that it's going to be short. So if I know that there's going to be a gap, then I can, I can try to do something. Something yeah. cool, but I'm trying I'm to say that I don't like your solos. You know, I, this is awkward. No, so yeah, I can. Uh, I'll give I'll give my approach to bass playing. How's that? Yeah, yeah, that's cool. Uh, my approach to bass playing is as many notes as possible in the shortest amount of time. So, I try to I try to go all the time, and then the notes just change. So I go to get the 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 and then I'll play notes in between there. It's pretty unique. It's pretty special. I've been kicked out of a lot of bands for my style. I'm just not even kidding. We don't do this all that often, but we do it from time to time, and a lot of times this type of thing is a writing thing where we'll sit in a in a room every day for a week and every day we just record ideas and record songs everybody brings songs to the table that type of thing this was stuff that already existed and so Barry set an ambitious schedule for us for the for the last like handful of days and was like we're gonna do all these songs all right, we're going, guys. doing a lot in a short period of time is always a good feeling like things that have a start and an end are are good like I like mowing my lawn a lot as you start and then you're done and you're like man I totally did that it doesn't matter the situation being in a band for a long period of time is, is hard and being on the road is is difficult and when you're in a band in your 20s you know you're sleeping on people's couches and stuff it's it's totally doable and it's totally um, you know you can just do it for fun but when you're in your 40s like we are except for Jesse, it's, it's hard. And the way that we do it, I think, is, is really unique. Should we get Terry and I jumping in the ocean? Yeah, yes. yes. definitely. Take off the lot well, before it. We are a family in every sense of the word. I mean, Terry's and Carter's kids call me Uncle John, and they call Barry Uncle Barry. Dude, dude, give me the black on. Come on, go do it. Right, do it. it for the company. Terry, do it. For the team. They're, go- they're going in. The I mean, we live on top of each other for half of the year, um, but we still get together and do family barbecues and stuff like that. I think it's, um, I don't know, something that, that I think is is incredibly unique um, just with the way that we tour and, and how we create together and the fact that we still, you know, love each other in, in the way that we love each other is pretty uh, pretty special. Just watch it go. The morning hits me up early 
my thoughts down the road I take what I find I keep my pockets lined Looking for gifts from the crows They follow me all through the branches They call out their signs of warning They gather and off they go They follow me all through the branches They call out their signs of warning They gather and off they go But I don't want to be all alone, all alone All alone, all alone All alone, all alone Shining on the way home I found a gift from the crows There's a candle set on the table There's an orange burning low in the sky There's a fragile piece washing over me But it never outpaces the night we're telling the tales of our longings And we're piercing the veil with our stars That we scored from memory And we're telling the tales of our longings And we're piercing the veil with our stars As we score the memory Shining on the way home I found these gifts from the crow I keep my pockets lined They're shining for me on the way home All of these gifts from the crow Not been here since I was a boy The sky unwrapped the world my toy A movie reel a million miles long it Goes on and on Scene after scene passes by my life The windows woo The road is a lie The irony asks me where have you been? I don't know, I don't know Because I don't know where to begin Too much to do, too much to see Pictures to take people to me when there's so much space in between It overwhelms me Scene after scene passes by my life The windows wound and the road is a lie The irony asks me Where have you been? I don't know, I don't know Because I don't know where to begin
Not been here since I was a boy Now a heart full of fear and a mask of painted joy So much for these youthful eyes to see So much for peace and tranquility One penny how close you are, how I feel Alone in a flat land between the dream and the real The irony asks me, where have you been? I don't know, I don't know, cause I don't know Jealous. <laughs> <laughs> 
was, that was your catch your instincts coming. Can we do a cut where? Can we do a cut where we all we're all playing different friends? And then we go. I'm wearing a Duke shirt. I'm like, like what the? F yeah, we should we should switch clothes. Yeah. <laughs> Just like everybody's in their spot, but like wearing each other. <laughs> Terry <laughs> shoved into the, my little. Dude, I'm sure. I wonder if people put Terry in your clothes. Oh, God. All right. Stand by.